Hey guys, and welcome to episode 3 of my Let's Play Plants vs. Zombies. Um, at the end of the last episode, I went and, um, like, got an achievement from showing you the potato, um, mine. So what I'm going to do is go to the achievements and show you that it, okay, that's highlighted. So that's one of the ones done. Yeah, there's some, there's some, like, freaky ones. Like, that's easy. Um, there's a few weird ones. The moustache one, you just have to do a cheat. It pretty much tells you that. Um, the mini games and such. So we're going to go on with, um, Adventure Mode Level 1-7. <laughs> and I want to restart the level just in case I wasted some time. So there's my house. There's the zombies. We've got two pogo sticks, guys, so that means they'll come a few times. Um, okay, start planting. Still just one row of sun. I don't feel the need for two yet. Oh, yeah, I don't feel the need for two. I'll see how much I get through with this, um, with this level. As you can see, the, um, snow pea is worth 175 sun, so that's like, you can nearly buy two of the pea shooters for that. Um, but they are, they are really good, so I'll just see how I'm feeling. Okay, and as you can see down the bottom here, there's two waves of zombies, so. Um, I'll just have to see. I may do, okay, a sun row, um, two pea shooter rows, and then a snow pea row. Normally call it, call it the frozen plant when I'm screaming to my brother on um, Xbox 360 to plant the right ones. Yes, yeah, so you can have, like, you can set, you can play with your, like, siblings or your friends or whatever, and you can set each other, like, roles. I'm the one that runs around and collects all the sun and bosses him around, and he's, like, the extra two hands that I don't have and plants all the plants where I want them to go. Um, now, yeah, just, like, building it up, as you can see. Lucky that I didn't plant that plant, the sun, but I have to plant it now, like, to get that before the um, first wave comes. We're halfway to the first wave. Um, okay, there's a pogo stick guy where I don't have anything. Um, freak. Pretty much screwed, hey? Nah, I'm not going to do that. Just wait. Okay, here we go. Hey, that walnut will stay there. It will slowly get all eaten away. Wow. A stupid touchpad. This guy better die. Okay, yeah, he'll be fine. He's dying. Okay, we've got a cone head, so they're stronger. They're even stronger than this guy. As soon as you get something, the first plant in his way, he'll jump it. Like, I could have just used a potato mine there and he would have jumped it, as he did in the level before. Okay, I've got enough, so. Oh, kidding me. Yeah, Stacey, you've got to pick up the sun first. Dickhead. Um, okay, so we're nearly up to the first wave. I'll pretty much have um, two rows of pea shooters done by then. As you can see, he's eating it. Uh, you'll slowly see him disintegrate. But yeah, then you get stronger walnuts as you go through the levels. And his face kind of drops and he doesn't smile as much anymore. Um, I'll see, you can see him fading away. Um, I've also decided to do the mini games and the puzzle mode at the end of my adventure mode, uh, just to get some formality as, like, so you know what's coming after each episode. I don't care if they get rid of him, because I didn't like him being there anyway. Okay, so I'll show you how a pea shooter works. See, they turn blue and they just slow right down. So that's my aim now, I've got a whole, um, roll of those. Someone will correct me and say column, but whatever. I don't know what one it is. And yes, I'm in year 12 at school, and yes, I don't care. So I'm just going to plant that, because like, food it will get eaten, but it only cost me 25. Um, okay, we put that there because there's a cone head. As you can see, this row here is fine. Are you kidding? And, oh, I'm going to have to use some water. Whatever. Uh, 
the two piece shooters can take out a cone head, but it just gets the process going quicker. Okay, that potato mine better like fast enough. Oh, what an idiot. So hopefully he like gets ready. Oh. The walnuts take a while to come out as well. I know no formality with these. I should have decided to do it like chewing or something. But he's ready now, so if something comes to him. And I will hit the um, row of um, snow peas as well before the last wave. Okay, there's another one of him, but we've got the walnut to be fine with that. This may. No, it won't. It won't even use the potato mind. Okay, waiting for another two more bits of sun. Okay, we see the um, pogo guy jump over where there's a walnut already. So I'm getting a bit lucky here. Um, but there's a there's one coming there, so. Okay. Um, I pretty much set up for all of that except for here. Um, so what I'll do is put a walnut here, just so we've got, just so like each line has something covered, at least. Um, I'll start planting another row of the pea shooters, I won't get enough. Okay, we'll shampoo, we'll shampoo someone there. So we re-put a shampoo there. probably get enough to put another pea shooter there and then I'll just leave it to see how it goes. Man, my voice is all crackly. I think it's because I'm recording and I normally, I haven't recorded in ages. <coughs> Excuse me. Okay, as you can see like now, yeah, the, the levels are getting like, not harder, but there's more zombies. Um, it's a longer, longer level, so that means um, more time for me to build up my plants. And, uh, yes, win. They were all perfectly fine. Now delete the evidence of my mistakes. Okay, that last bit of sun, and there is our unlock plant. And it is a chomper. Um, Devours is a zombie hole, but is vul vulnerable while chewing. Uh, it chews the first zombie that it can, but then it kind of has to digest the zombie. Oh, okay, now you can see we've got more than six plants, like I said before. Um, you can also see further to the right that there's a zombie with a metal um, bucket on its head. They are harder, again, to beat. Um, I'd probably use, like, oh, I'd use two pea shooters and then a snow shooter to come, like, to be... Um, confident in beating such a thing. Um, I'm going to go on and do one more level before I switch it off. Um, as you can see, I've got a format. You'll see that it will be exactly the same. Um, okay. Let's see how many... Um, okay, 1-8 we're on now. Let's see how many waves of zombies we'll get once it tells me. It doesn't tell you straight away, I believe it tells you when the first zombie um, arrives. So. Yeah, okay, oh, there's only one. Alright, maybe because they're bringing in that new steel cap one. Honestly, shitting my pants for that. Maybe I should have done... Ah, oh. uh, soon I'll start doing two rows of sun, but... Not frequent enough yet. Okay. So just a normal zombie there, and then another one coming in the same place, so that gives me time to start uh, getting building my sun up. Um, I'll wait till 150 just in case another zombie comes, so that's fine now, I've got another sun. That ended up really lucky that he came on the same row. Uh, straight away. Um, ready, now we've got my sun already done, so now for the rest of the level I'll just build up the pea shooters. I could have done a lot more sun because it, see, it just, okay, um, they brought out two zombies in two places I didn't have any pea shooters lined up on, so, let's quickly.
quickly going with those. And just one more gap until I make one row full of pea shooters, so... And I'm about halfway through the level. What I'll probably get to do this level is two rows of um, pea shooters, and then I'll keep a snow um, pea just as soon as I see that metal-headed one. I'm going to go hard out, like... Or I may even put it... Oh, there it is. Oh, no. Okay. I just... I really want to get one of the snow ones winner. I hate it so much. Like it's because I slowed it down now. I'm even gonna put okay, another pea shooter there. That's how bad. Okay, as you can see, I've slowly dinted it, but I've kind of got to get it right off. I'm even half tempted to put one of those there, but I know that I'm freaking out for nothing. Okay, so he's slowly dying, and I want another pea shooter there. Okay, um, yeah, okay, his hat's off. I've pretty much got him. As you can see, like, he is a biatch to kill. Um, yeah, I needed moss on this level. And just, yeah, I'll, f I'll reach and I'll get, um, two rows of the pea shooters like I thought. Just worried about having enough for a snow pea as soon as the metal head guy comes. Metal bucket guy. Okay, that's fine. 25, 50, 75, 100. Oh, the suspense. Okay, a huge wave of zombies is approaching! Exclamation mark. I'd love to show you what it says if you act, if one of them actually reach your house, but I, like, I'm not trying to sound cocky. I don't think it will happen um, in the adventure mode for me. Like, it may happen in a mini game or something. Because some of them are so gay to complete. Okay, we've pretty much the, the levels done with ease here. And this will be the end of episode 3 once I complete it. Oh, it feels funny. Like, I can't believe my voice is actually hurting, even though I've been at school all day talking. Okay, winner. Got heaps of this sun. No use using it, so I'll just leave it there. About to kill the last zombie, and here we go. We've unlocked a mother of a thing. 200 sun, you're asking why? What is it? Okay, what it is, is a repeater. Um, it fires two peas at a time, so it's double the price as a normal pea shooter, but it only takes up one um, space, which kind of uh, is useful when you get th um, more through the game. Oh, I click next level again. Fire out. Um, okay, we're going to go to the main menu, because that is the end of episode three, guys. Um... Oh, whoops. Rate, comment, and subscribe.